page two from A Fish in Water of Thirst, The Globetrotting Adventures of a Meditating Angler and Diver by Mario Caputo. That's me, Mario. Page two. The second boat I built was a fishing skiff, which helped me explore larger lakes. After a few seasons, I gave that boat to a friend. I think he made it into a flower garden. Today, my third boat, the St. Mary, is parked in the barn at the farm, and she is seaworthy. The first time I took the St. Mary out, I put her on the Rock River near an early and still marked horse-drawn ferry crossing in Rockton, Illinois. I had just finished the project the day before, and needless to say, I was excited and eager to get my boat on the water. I was so bemused, in fact, that I hadn't paid much attention to the height of the river. It was in flood stage. When I discovered that the ramp at the local park was closed, I cleverly found a way around the yellow emergency barricades. Parking near the churning boat ramp, I lifted my new skiff off the roof of the car. Upon launching, I found that my only motor, a little electric trolling motor my Uncle Dick had given me when he outgrew it, would not start. I felt a little bit like a kid on his first ride down the big slide at the water park, and I watched, with some trepidation as my beckoning Nissan disappeared behind a screen of trees. Frightening as it was, I was determined to have a good float now that I was out of range of the boat landing. My white-knuckled enthusiasm made me oblivious to any danger. Tomorrow, look forward to page three from A Fish in Water of Thirst. Thank you. Namaste.